like to call the uh, uh, public hearing uh, for the purpose of our district emergency plan to order. Um, as uh, required by uh, New York State Commissioner of Education, we have to hold a public meeting prior to uh, or annually to approve our district's emergency response plan. Uh, the, our emergency response plan will live on our district website. However, the public version, which is what we are approving tonight, is a heavily redacted version for obvious reasons as our emergency response plan includes uh, many safety protocols as well as contact information for uh, many of our school officials and uh, also provides valuable insight into uh, our buildings. So as you can imagine, uh, the public version of the emergency response plan does not contain such sensitive information, but it is a, uh, an extremely comprehensive document. Uh, I think uh, if, if you can just at least uh, share the table of contents with our viewers at home, it is, uh, it's a, uh, again, it's a very comprehensive document that uh, we're fortunate in that the um, state has used our emergency response plan as a template uh, in many of their uh, conferences. The building specific emergency response plans will be uh, coming in the next two weeks or so. Um, we've had a lot of new folks in our district over the uh, past year. So uh, we will work with our administrative team to make sure that uh, everyone is represented properly and all the information is correct. And uh, yeah, other than that, there's not a lot more to it than that, but I would certainly entertain questions if anyone has uh, any questions. Did not really make any revisions, correct? The only revision is uh, the inclusion of the uh, COVID-19 specific protocol that was required uh, by the state last March. So it was actually uh, submitted to the state uh, last March, but now included as part of uh, our emergency response plan. Other than that, believe it or not, we, we had a mass illness slash epidemic uh, protocol, uh, hoping that we would never, ever need it. Uh, but the uh, state had put out some guidance requiring us to provide some more specific uh, processes relative to uh, how we do things here. So that uh, is the only revision. There are some obvious uh, amendments in terms of uh, personnel and district safety teams that we will you know, work together uh, over the next couple of weeks and solidify all of that. Um, but other than that, uh, nothing, nothing major at all. Did you want to mention how the public can ask questions? Oh, sure. Yeah. In, in the uh, is, is it Q and A or is it chat? Q and A. Um, those of you viewing from home, if we have any, the uh, okay. Uh, feel free to type your questions into the uh, Q and A. You just click on that on the bottom of the screen, and they will pop up, and uh, I will gladly answer them. Questions for now, specifically. Yeah, just specific to the public hearing for the purpose of the emergency response plan. Anyone in the room have a question? Hmm. Right, so we'll, we'll give a chance for our folks at home to type anything in if they wish. At this time, seeing that there are no questions uh, or comments, we will adjourn this meeting and uh, return for our uh, general uh, meeting of the Board of Education at 6 o'clock. Meeting adjourned. Yeah. Hey, Rob. How do I pause? <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, we started again. Yeah. Give or end. Thank <laughs> you.